room. I am so glad that you could join me. I thought I would take this time to share with you an update on the challenge that my local yarny friend and I challenged each other to. Uh, she gave me a pattern to make and I gave her a pattern to make and we both made those. Our deadline is Monday, Monday, January 24th, which this should be going up for that day because we both haven't finished a little bit early. But anyway, she challenged me to make a scarf and I challenged her to make a fish scrubby slash washcloth. Now, I will put a link down in the description to our my original video on this and to the links for these patterns in case you're interested. They are both free patterns on the internet. So, the scarf that she challenged me to, I can't remember the name of it, and I can't remember, Be Calm, I think is the name of this yarn. I didn't bring the rest of it down here to my craft room. I've got just under two ounces left and I made this a preschool size so about like for a five-year-old but this is my scarf it is all my tails are woven in <laughs> it's done here is a close-up if you want to see that stitch it's really cool and it is just a two row repeat it is a row of double crochets and then a row of single crochet and chain super easy to make and yeah i thought it was pretty cool so i will be adding this to my donation bucket for scarves i don't know how many i'm going to make or where i'm going to donate them yet but i have made a few and i will add this to it and the my friend like i said made the fish scrubby slash washcloth so I will insert a picture of her finished project for you to see as well. So now that we have them done, we decided to swap projects like I said we might do in my first video. So she is working on the scarf. And I'm going to be working on the fish scrubby slash washcloth. And we gave ourselves two weeks again. But if we get them finished before then, then I will be back with a video of our finished projects for you to um, see how we did. So thank you guys for joining me here in the craft room. And I will see you right back here for my next video.